breaking news pro biafra group the biafra nations league bnl has directed its fighters to mount roadblocks on major roads in the southern southeast pardon on april 8. the group said it gave the order following the indigenous people of biafra hyperblida and amnicanos court proceedings coming up on the particular date bnl like ipop is seeking to break the southeast away from nigeria to form an independent country called biafra a statement issued by its leader prince will c richards also directed members to block all border entrances a statement released by the separatist group on Wednesday said the leader of the Biafra Nations League BNL Prince Will C. Richards has directed its members to mount roadblocks roadblock entrance at the border entrance pardon in solidarity with Enandi Kano's court case coming up in April 8, the BNL leader also called on all militias loyal to the group in the Bakasi Peninsula to ensure that any oil worker who has been defying the group's order to shut down operations is apprehended on the said day. Richard said BNL we continue to threaten oil companies in the region unless they come to an agreement which must include stopping the 60% Nigeria derives from oil in the eastern end of the Gulf of Guinea. The BNL leader gave this directive today during a meeting with Ejakam supporters of the group in Eku. Ekukunenla, Ikom local government area of Cross River State. He said, Arrangements are on ground to ensure that they are able to outsmart both Nigeria and Cameroonian security operatives to secure oil companies at Maritime border. Recall that a few weeks ago, an attempt was reportedly made to apprehend two French oil workers in Bakasi by a militant group suspected to be BNL members. The group has vowed not to resume hostilities in the peninsula. What is your thought to this? What is your own reaction? We've just had, according to the news, a pro Biafra group, the Biafra Nations League, BNL has directed its fighters to mount roadblocks on major routes in the southeast on April 8. And this April 8 is the next adjournment date of Mazi in Amdikanu, of which he will be appearing in court. What is your own point of view to this? According to the news, the group said it gave the order following the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB leader in Amdikanu's court proceedings coming up on that particular date. What is your thought to this? Like what has been said times to the number that Mazin Amdikanu supporters, that is the IPOB, are doing everything possible in solidarity of Mazin Amdikanu, they are doing everything possible to make sure that their leader gets out of detention and until it's been released nothing will be done against the IPOB that they won't retaliate. Now they said it there will be roadblock on Southeast Major Road to support Inam Dikano. What is your own reaction to this? We would like you to let us know your own thoughts to this that has been said but before we go Let's see people's reactions to this. Manuel said, This group is fake and championed by Nigerian DSS. IPOB is a peaceful liberation struggle organization 
Nigerian DSAs stop the evil you are perpetrating in the eastern part against the innocent and peaceful loving Easterners. That is a reaction from Manuel saying that the DSAs are the ones who are behind this because IPO is a peace, you know, a peaceful organization fighting for the liberation of its own innocent people. What is your thought to this? Adaga also reacted and said they don't dare it. They will be resisted. I love IPOP, but why are they doing all these things? Only in the Southeast. Is Southeast the only Biafra land? And is Biafra only for the Southeast? I thought they should be doing it in all Biafra land and territory, like Wari Asaba, Uju Ogoja, Jenegua River State, Akwaibom State, Cross River State, and the rest. Why only? In the southeast state. What is your thought to this? We've just had a reaction from Ephraim. One call saying that I love IPOP, but why are they doing all those things in Southeast alone? Or are you saying that Southeast that is Biafra is only for Southeast? Or are you saying that Biafra is only for the Southeasterners alone? All these things also should be done in states like Cross River State, Aquaibam State, places like Wari, Asaba, Yenegua River State, Uyo, and other parts of the states that are related to the southern, you know, southern part of Nigeria. Why is it only happening in Southeast State alone? What is your thought to this? What is your own reaction? We would like you to let us know your thoughts on this. People might be wondering why is IPOP always coming up with things like this? Why is IPOP always, you know, trying to do one or two anytime Mazen Abdikam is appearing in court? Don't forget that IPOP have said we will continue to do everything in solidarity to Mazen Abdikam until he is being released. And according to the news, a pro Biafra group, that is the BNL, has gives dates to mount roadblocks on southeast major routes to support Enamdi Kanu. Mazen Amdi Kanu is to appear in court April 8th and now that same date has been given to mount roadblock on southeast major roads to support Mazen Amdi Kanu. Any day is to appear in court something must be done. If not locked down there will be a roadblock. This is the work of IPOP of which some people have said it is good while some people have said why are you doing this you shouldn't be doing all those things don't forget all the Mazen Abdikan is released all this will not stop we would like you to let us know your own thoughts today thank you guys for listening to subscribe to this channel if you have not and i will see you on other news bye for now